What's up fam? Hope everybody's doing fantastic out there. Welcome to Mail Call Friday edition. Um, today I've got some some very exciting stuff here. I am uh, really excited about this box and this box. I know exactly what's in this. This is a trade uh, from my buddy Mr. Mike Watkins. Uh, if you're following on Facebook, you guys probably know who he, who he is. Uh, he does some knife customization and other things. Uh, but we did a little bit of a trade deal, so we're going to open that one first, then we'll go into the box here from our friends at the Crispy Donut community, and then last but not least, a little bit of County Com love. So I'm going to move the uh, massive County Com box over here out of the way for just a moment, um, and then we are going to get right into the uh, trade unboxing. So let me just crack into this thing real quick. I'm going to be careful because I don't know exactly, I mean, I, I know what knife is in here, but it definitely feels like there's something else. So I'm just going to try to um, open this up very gently. Take a little peeky, a little peek do inside here. Make sure I'm not, again, not cutting anything that doesn't need to be cut. Uh, let's see here. Alrighty. So let me just go ahead and just slide this pouch out of there. I think it's all that's in there. Okay, yep, okay. It's just the pouch in there, but with the uh, bag being folded over, it definitely felt like there was more in there. So throw that into the trash box here. I'm going to go ahead and get kind of set up for a more normal looking video. So I had to do a, 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 a horizontal video today just because of the size of that one box. But we uh, we will do this like normal anyway. So I uh, traded out a, uh, I had a brand new O-Knife um, Roboto for, it was the S35 and uh, Ultim. Um, and uh, it, and, yeah, I'm just kind of, I'm not feeling crossbar locks as much anymore. So it wasn't one that I was ever going to carry. I'm not a huge fan of drop points as uh, you guys are probably aware. I like the uh, more Warren Cliffy blades anyway. And I've been wanting to get one of these um, visions for a long time. So finally got a vision. Uh, it is the Black Blade Ultim one, as you guys can see. It has micro milling on the Ultim, which is really cool. I do like that more than the Smooth Ultim. And I like the black on the Ultim more than I do the uh, Satin. So that was uh, that was the trade there. Really happy with that. So we'll go ahead and uh, put up the uh, Gen Vaquero. We'll use the Vision to crack open the box from... Our friends at Crispy Donut Community. Now this, if I'm not mistaken, is a very special unboxing for me. Um, a very special unboxing for uh, Crispy Donut Community. This is, if I'm not mistaken, this is the Outbreak. Um, I'm hoping I'm not mistaken anyway. <laughs> uh, let's see here. It's a box. It's a knife box. Let me get rid of some of this. Some of these peanuts. Oh, boy. So, part of the... Yeah, this has got to be the outbreak. So, part of the reason this excites me so much is because, um, yeah, whether you know or not, but um, I did... I am responsible for the name of this knife. Um, I thought it was a cool little play on CDC outbreak. Uh, but this is, yes it is, oh my goodness, hell yeah, okay. So this is uh, uh, Crispy Donut Community's first uh, premium knife. So you get uh, a Patient Zero card, which is pretty cool. Um, just a nice little, a cool little, you know, pocket trash, whatever you want to call it. Cool little uh, memento, then their typical little card there. And then you have the knife, um, Best Tech OEM'd. Um, all right, yeah, buddy. So you've got the sprinkle pattern milled into the titanium. 
Magna Cut blade, blacked out hardware, crazy jimping that uh, Luke's designs are known for. I've already done a video on this knife, um, so you guys have hopefully seen that. Let's see if I can reverse flick it. Uh, that detent might be a little too stiff for me to reverse flick. I might have to do a little bit of a tune. Uh, yep, I'm going to have to break it in probably, but the thumb stud is great. The flipper action is phenomenal. I think flips like crazy. Good jimping. Very well done jimping there. Right out of the box. Can't complain. So, uh, yeah, this one I'm really excited about. Like I said, uh, I love having a little piece of me with this knife as well. You know, it, it wasn't much I contributed, <laughs> you know, but um, knowing that there's a knife I named out there is pretty cool. So, especially with uh, some good friends. So, really excited about that. Uh, that will probably be my carry today for Flipper Friday. Um, let's go ahead and crack into this guy here uh i know what is in here so we are going to um just crack into this i'm only going to open up part of it uh well i mean you guys are going to see what's in here but i'm not going to open um everything out of here because one of the things that i got was a uh, mystery pack so i'm not going to go through each individual part of that because that will ruin the uh unboxing experience or the uh, experience for that mystery pack box but going in here without letting y'all see too much we do have god i still don't know how they, i mean i see now how they fit it in there but um first thing we have is the one of their packs this is the um the new urban urban hall i believe it's called in gray so again we're gonna wait on uh more information on that and then there is a absolute badass chonker of a flashlight man this thing doesn't weigh anything either it comes with a uh, pocket clip o-rings and stuff in there uh, but this is a laser light. So this is a laser flashlight. I bet you there's not a battery in it. Is that why it doesn't weigh anything? Yeah, okay. So yeah, it uh, you have to put a battery in it. I think it takes 18650 if I'm not mistaken. I can't remember exactly what size battery it takes. But there will be more info on this when the uh, video goes live. But this is a laser flashlight. Um, so anyway, guys, uh, that is all I've got. Uh, that and then, uh, of course, some awesome stuff in here and i can already tell just by looking in here that it is going to be a bit of an epic little unboxing for that so i appreciate y'all as always please remember be kind be humble be edc we'll catch you on the next one